Well, it is a proud moment for Sheriff Phil Plummer and the Dayton Police Department. They have been pushing this for years, but right now one Dayton neighborhood is stepping up, taking the initiative, and taking back its community. Sheriff Phil Plummer has plenty of practice putting together block parties to stop violence on Montgomery County streets. He's been behind dozens across the county, but tonight he's not the one in charge. Now neighborhoods are calling us to assist with block parties, which is a good feeling. You know, people are finally taking ownership of their neighborhoods. The call came from James Render, a resident of the Wentworth neighborhood. I'm just a resident, you know, uh, that's just sick and tired of being sick and tired. That's all. Render says he's seen violence and drugs drugs in and around his neighborhood on a daily basis. Just last week, 15-year-old Renika Clemens was shot and killed on the playground at Westwood Elementary, blocks away from Wentworth. You know, this community's had the share of gun violence lately. Sheriff Plummer says with law enforcement cutbacks due to the economy, neighborhoods are needed more than ever. We want to come together and improve our health uh, by reducing crime, drugs, and violence in our neighborhood. In the shooting at Westwood, nearly 100 people were at the park when it happened, but no one defused the situation until it was too late. Half of them probably knew the kid had a gun. We need them to tell us who's carrying the guns so we can you know, prevent that kind of stuff from happening. Well, the block party will be held Saturday, July 3rd from 10 to 4. It will be near the intersection of Salem Avenue and Wentworth Avenue. Not only will there be great information there, they're also having a yard sale, talent show, and plenty of games. Obviously, Montgomery County Sheriff's Office will be there and Dayton Police. Now, Sheriff Plummer uses money from seized, seized drug money to put on these block parties. Reporting live in Dayton, Holly Samuels, 2 News on your side.